I haven't run the numbers, but I have probably done more videos for Ted Naife than I have anyone else. I am a long-term fan of his work, most specifically the Crumrin series. There are two. There's uh, the Crumrin Chronicles is the new series. There's a volume two coming soon, says September. Um, but she has a prior series as well that ran for seven or eight volumes. Uh, so I really enjoy his work, and I wasn't aware that Witch for Hire even existed. This came out in 2021. I was online looking for something else, stumbled on this by accident, uh, grabbed it, read it. It is good, but it's not one of my favorites. I'll tell you why. So I think I'll start off by talking about the title. So this Witch for Hire, there are sort of two main characters, which is sort of where the weirdness begins. So this here is Faye, and this here is Cody. Cody starts out as the main character. We're seeing uh, sort of a new school from her perspective. Uh, her older sister is already in the school, so it's sort of a freshman coming to high school situation. Um, but her sister's already there. Her sister is more popular than she is and wants nothing to do with Cody. She winds up at the loser table with Faye and some others, and Faye is there because she wears this witch hat that she sort of refuses to take off. The story itself is about bullying, it's about fitting in, it's about changing yourself to conform, it's about kind of a lot of things. But there is young girls, there's magic, it could very easily fit into the Crumrin universe, however, there's no connection that I could find. Most of his work has been put out through Oni, which is currently going through some turmoil. It's kind of a mess over there, according to reports. This is put out by Amulet. I don't know if that is an indication of anything. I honestly don't know really much about the future of Ted's work, even though I have tried to figure it out. I'm still waiting for Chris Volume 2, but um, anyway, back to the title. So, Witch for Hire. Faye very much is not a Witch for Hire. She's adamantly not for most of this title. She becomes it, minor spoiler, at the very end. So for 99% of the book, the title does not fit. And I think that would be okay if... I, once again, I don't know the future for this if it's going to be a series or if this is a one-shot. If it's a one-shot, then the title just should have been changed to something more appropriate. If it's the beginning of a series, then this could be the title for the series, and this particular volume would have had a subtitle, something to indicate that it is the beginning of her career. I don't... I can't think of anything off the top of my head. I'm not paid to create titles, but I'm just saying the title is a bit misleading. Um, I also think because there's sort of two main characters, it switches from Cody to Faye maybe halfway through, that neither one really gets a focus. Cody gets quite a bit. She's developed pretty well. Um, it's just... I Her arc does have an conclusion. It's nice. And the same with Faye. I just don't think there's the sort of focus that either one has or receives if they would have been the main character throughout the entire book. I... I don't know. That's sort of a... It's one of those things that I think some of his other work does better. You know, Crumrin specifically, Chris does as well. It's it's excellent. There's one character focused the entire time. But um, this is, it's still good. As I said, it's just not as good as some of his other stuff. And here is an example of the art for those unfamiliar with his work. I don't think that's very exciting, but here we have a witch using a computer. There's something that I find amusing about that. And here we have... I, I do love these backgrounds. It's really nice stuff. So, Cody, and it turns out more students at the school are being bullied 
there is this creature here and uh, Faye winds up tackling it she deals with it because it is of magical origin it's good it's just not one of his best if you are interested uh, go ahead and pick it up or pick up any of his other stuff Crumrin or Chris or I just reviewed what did I review? Polly and the Pirates all excellent so I I will try to search again see if there's any sort of future for this if it is a series or what's happening with Chris and if I learn anything I'll throw that into the final version of this video